My name is Pova, and this is putting a game on the Google Play Store. There are a few things wrong with that sentence. A. My name is Pova. B. How the shit do I make a mobile game? And C. What's the Google Play Store? You should, you should put it on the App Store because they don't steal your data and there's more people and, and, and it's better. <laughs> well, some of that is true, I don't care because I have to make a mobile game before worrying about that. Making a playable game can be pretty hard, but I think I have a solution. On the screen now is a quick C hashtag script I put together which works in command prompt. All it does is make a game with one command, which includes rendering, gameplay, music, and audio. Obviously you can't just generate games, this one here was actually made in this video. But the game I made in that video doesn't work for phones or anything mobile. And since mobile is where the game is targeted for, I need to make it mobile. Because you're not just going to sit on your PC playing a 2D platform game when you could be playing a game with graphics. If you made it this far into the video, you might be wondering, why don't you put this game on the app store? And I'll say, because you have to pay, because it's a lot more difficult. Alright, well then you might say, why put a game on the play store and nobody will play it? Well obviously to make money, I mean because when I was 5 I had no money, and every day there was a 50% chance of survival because of the water I had to drink from that 800 year old well. To make a game work for mobile, you first need touchscreen controls. Unless you are that person that connects their Bluetooth keyboard to their iPhone 14 just to play Fortnite. You're gonna need controls. So I made some buttons with Unity's easy to use button maker and made them control the character. After that, I made a settings button so you can go back to the menu and restart the game. The icon for the settings button is from Icons 8, which is a really good place to get free icons. Maybe one day. Next, I added a settings menu. I was going to add a shop as well so you could buy skins with an in-game currency. and a settings menu so you can adjust things like graphics, audio and level difficulty, but I think I'll leave that for the next update. At this point, the game is pretty much mobilized, so it works for phones. The next thing to do was to implement ads to get that bread. I used interstitial ads, which basically means skippable 5 second ads. To be honest, I don't even know how much I'll make. There is a very good chance I don't make anything, but I still did some research, and according to Google, it's something like $6 to $12 per 1000 impressions. And if I do make any money, it will go straight to more competitions like the one mentioned later in this video. I made sure not to add too many of them so the game still feels like you paid for it. The code used was actually Unity provided, which made it take minutes to work however that doesn't really matter unless i release it on the google play store because you're not really gonna download a random apk on your phone that could be some random malware putting a game on the google play store was actually much easier than expected because after watching a video on how to put a game in the play store i was left just as confused as i was before it started nevertheless i worked it out using stack overflow as my walking stick and i managed to send it out for review within about four hours the next three days of my life were pretty stressful because every day i would come home check if it was reviewed be sad that it wasn't and worry that the game was too shit for the play store however a total of four days later it was reviewed and rolled out for production but as I mentioned before, because when I was 5 I had no money, and every day there was a 50% chance of survival because of the water I had to drink from that 800 year old well. Now I don't want any other person to go without drinkable water, so I'm hosting a tournament. Taking place from the 10th of October all the way to the 25th of December, there are 5 money prizes to be won. The prizes are paid by PayPal. To enter, you have to send a screenshot of you beating my game to povabusiness at gmail.com. The winner will be the person with the best time, and I'll have a leaderboard up in my Discord server as well, so you can see if you are the best. Link to the Google Play is in the description, and for PC as well. Have you ever wanted to have your comment pinned? Well, if you guess how many likes this video will have after three days of uploading, I'll pin your comment. And with that, thank you for watching this video. If you like, then like. If you want to see more videos, then subscribe. And see you next time.